Hey friends, welcome back to the channel. I'm Marshall Gamer, and today we are checking out Shogun Showdown. I stumbled across this game randomly on HIO, and I played it for a little bit, and I just loved the concept of it, so I wanted to bring this to your attention. Uh, this game is currently free on HIO, and I will have the link for you down in the bottom of um, in the description. Um, let's jump right in. So it is a, a roguelike, um, like uh, no other that I've seen. Um, but instead of just trying to explain it, because that's going to be difficult to explain, I'll, I'll just play it and show it, show it off to you guys. Um, let's. Uh, we have a few characters that we can play with. Um, we have the assassin that can swap places, and the wanderer also swaps places, but has a. Uh, more HP. Um, the assassin has an insta kill. Um, the squares you see at the bottom here are the number of turns it takes for the skill to um, re regenerate. And then um, the number on it is obviously just the, the damage that you can do. So let's just jump right in and I'm gonna go with the wanderer because I've had the most success with him. So as you can see here um, this is your character right here and you can move back and forth and this signifies that the enemy is adding um, something into their attack queue so um, but before we can actually attack him um, we need to turn around or um, some cards allow us to attack even with our backs turned so we'll do that and then um, you can engage combat by hitting right click it'll basically execute anything that's in your queue so we have this enemy here, so we're going to turn around to face them, and then we're going to add the aerial attack to our Q. And we always go first, so we, we have that advantage going for us. So we're going to do this, and we're going to just take out the enemy. So uh, this means they're about to attack. As, as long as we move out of range, we're good. And we'll shoot them down. And between stages, we get the option, um, sometimes we get the option to pick a card between two cards. Or, um, sometimes we get something that'll power up our cards. So for now, let's see. Strike the cell in front of you pushes back the enemy. It has a three turn cooldown. Um, the arrow is a pretty good. Um, so I might pick up the arrow actually, just so I can have more... Uh, more options here when it comes to ranged attacking. So here you can see we have enemies on either side. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to take out this side first. And this guy has two health, this guy has three, so he's gonna survive. That's fine. It is what it is. So this guy is trying to come after me. So I'm gonna turn around. Oh, um. Uh, so here, um, actually this was a miscalculation on my part, so I'm going to take two damage here, unfortunately. But we're going to finish that off, and then we'll have this and this, and we got that out. So far it seems like we're doing okay. And we can turn around here, add this and add this, and then move in and do a double here. I'm gonna turn around. As long as um, I kind of kite the enemy, uh, I'm, I'm usually okay. So here, um, smoke bomb, swap position with the first enemy in front of you. Or I can use the Dragon Punch to push back an enemy. Let's try to play with the Smoke Bomb. So this guy I can just uh, take out in one shot here. Then I'm going to turn around. I'm going to add a sword and this to my attacks. 
and you do a combo there. So the smoke bomb actually does one damage right away. So I'm gonna move back. I, I, I'm gonna shoot him and then use the smoke bomb and I think it kills him because it says here that it does damage. That's cool. So this is a dash attack. It'll basically attack the first enemy or um, the first units that that's in front of them. But as long as you take them out before, you're good. Oh no. That was, a, that was a mistake, actually. A misclick, if you will. Um, we can use this to... Uh, we have potions on the left here that we can use. Um, kind of like uh, Slay the Spire, I guess. Oh, no. We have to take out this guy. I love the mechanics in this game. They're so good. So far the combat is easy, but um, you'll see what I mean about the combat getting harder. So here we have an upgrade that we can do. Um, it'll add a double strike effect, but it'll increase the cooldown by four, so we can we can upgrade this and basically um, it'll add a double strike to it, so it'll attack twice. But then instead of, of four turns, I'm gonna, uh, I mean three turns, I'm gonna have to wait eight turns. Um, or, sorry, I can't math today. Um, I meant seven turns total. Or we can try to reroll and see what we can get. So this adds a poison effect, but it increases the cooldown by two. Um, again, I don't want anything that'll increase my cooldown, so I think I'll take the dash. And here we have a boss. Um, so right now we don't know what the boss is gonna do. But I'm gonna queue up my two arrows. So he's gonna dash at me. Um, so what I'm gonna do is... I'm actually gonna move in and then he's gonna add another card so it means he's not gonna execute his attack so what I could do is attack him twice right now just for some free damage and then what I could do is um, this so now he is gonna attack me but um, since my, my special ability here is if I move to an area where the enemy is already occupying. I will swap places with them, like that. Um, but the ability does have a cooldown, as you can see there. Um, I think it's five turns or four turns. So now we know he's gonna attack with that. Um, and we don't wanna get caught in that. So we're gonna trigger it, and then we're gonna back off, and then we're gonna do that. Again, same thing. This time we can deal some real damage here. Now we can swap places with him so he doesn't attack us with that. Perfect. So I can attack him twice there. Now he's gonna try to attack me, but I'm not gonna allow that. So he's gonna try and do that. I'm gonna swap places with him. Oh, maybe that wasn't the, the best idea? No, it's fine. Um, because um, I didn't use my ability, I used my uh, my card. So now I can actually do that and avoid some damage right there. Can also do that and he's down and we didn't take any damage perfect 
So here, um, this upgrade is actually pretty nice. It just reduces our cooldown with no uh, no no downside. So we'll go ahead and reduce the cooldown on our uh, sword attack. Actually, no. Um, maybe I want to do it on the smoke screen, so, so I can have more uh, maneuverability. So here we have the cauldron. We can uh, buy some potions. We can also stash them and uh, pick them up at a at a later um, stop. We can also um, heal and uh, trade our health for money. Some of the stuff we can do is. Um, some of the stuff we can do is um, increasing the drops of the enemy. There's also um, more damage when we're hitting enemies from farther away. And increasing your uh, potion, um, increasing your potion slots. Oh, that was weird. Um, my computer had a weird hiccup there. Um, anyway, um, let's uh, let's move on. Uh, I guess we can pick this up because uh, actually, maybe we'll pick up the more drops. Uh, the extra damage would also be nice. Actually, let's go with extra damage just in case, and let's go. Here we go. Okay, so... We'll shoot this guy. Turn around. And we're gonna... So this guy has a spear. He can attack me from two tiles away. We don't want that, so we're gonna back out and then move in for an easy kill. Uh, this guy... Oh no. Okay, so this guy is gonna attack me. Uh, that was a mistake. Okay. So we'll do this. And we'll finish him off before he can do anything to us. So we'll dash, smoke screen, and then heal dash into this guy. Um, ay ay ay. That's not good. Here. So we're gonna take some damage here. Which is unfortunate, but that's okay. So we can increase the damage of one of our abilities. I think we'll do this. So we'll do this here. And we'll do... One... Two. We'll shoot and trade places. And then we can dash and attack. Turn around and we can just back off here and then shoot him. So here, what can we do? So it says uh, d plus one damage when hitting from four cells. Does that mean the fourth cell is what counts or is it like f counting my cell too? sure okay they're both trying to attack so I'm gonna add an attack here and then there oh he kind of uh, took out his friend there oh no 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 
That was a big mistake. Okay. We used the shield to just uh, make sure we didn't uh, get destroyed there by that, that attack. Now, take out that guy. Now this guy, we can dash towards him. What if we dashed, traded, and then did a triple? Now, we'll just do a, a dash triple. And then back off. And then we'll just shoot twice. I'll... I'll add this. And then use it. And he... Okay. Perfect. And now I can dash and shoot him with the arrow. Easy. So I can upgrade some stuff. I, I can upgrade this again to have it have less cooldown. But maybe I want to upgrade my arrow this time. So each each card um, will have a limited number of upgrades. Um, as you can see here, these were already upgraded. So they have three more upgrades for the swords. And then one more upgrade for the smoke smoke screen. Okay, um, that's an archer. Let's take them out first. And then we'll take out this guy. Take out the archer. Turn around. We'll dash and shoot. Turn around. Attack, shoot. Shoot. How do I do this? Um, I can shoot. Attack. So another mechanic I forgot to mention is um, while your cards are already there, um, you can you can rearrange them. So you can rearrange uh, how the attacks go. So I, I could dash over and then shoot and then triple, but I'll, I'll, I will still get attacked, I think. Unless... Um, so once this is full and has three attacks, you can't really change them. Um, you can't replace them. You can you can just reorganize the, what you already have. So if I dash and then attack with the sword, that's four, and then I can shoot. Dash, attack with the sword, and then the two damage goes to this guy. And then I can back off and shoot him. And then I can kind of just wait out the cooldown for this. I can do this and this. So I'll, sw I'll swap places with this guy and then I'll attack this guy for two. And then I can turn around and dash at this guy, but I, I will get hit first. So we can use some potions here just to uh, keep ourselves topped off. And we'll just shoot twice. GG's. We can add the ice effect, but also add three cooldown. So, so the maximum cooldown, you, you can't go over 7, apparently. I'll go with uh, a shuriken, actually. Another boss. Alright. What's his uh, thing? Uh oh. Okay. 
Okay, so we'll attack this guy and then we'll dash to him and shoot him. Okay, so I just need to break his shield when he puts it up. I can turn around and... Shoot, and then... Oh! He's trying to swap places with me? Okay, that works. Oh, the sniped uh, ability is actually giving me a lot of damage here. I am taking a lot of damage too, so maybe I'll, I'll uh, fill up. And then I can... Since these guys are cornered behind him, he can't really uh, use them. So I can just dash at him. Can I do that? And then shuriken him. Oh, perfect. Alright, we reduced the cooldown here, and uh, what do we want to reduce the cooldown of? We can reduce the cooldown of the arrows again, have them be super short. I mean, do this so we can balance ourselves out a little bit more. And we can pick up another one for more damage here. Plus one damage for attack following a movement tile. Start fight with a shield. We'll do this, and actually we'll do this too. Ooh, this is a big boy. What if we did sure you can dash attack? Okay. Sure you can dash smoke screen. Attack shoot. Shuriken dash. Well, um, I guess we'll do it like this. Um, we'll shoot him first and then dash. Oh wait! Did I did I miscalculate there? I think I did. Okay. We'll do. This guy has a spear, this guy is the uh, one in, all the way in the back, so we're good. Um, we'll do... This, this, this. We'll shoot twice. And this guy has five. We can... Sure can dash blade. Nice. We'll increase the damage on our shuriken. Ooh, this guy. This guy looks uh, interesting. How do I want to deal with him? Um, Just shoot him? No. 
I don't know what that is, but it doesn't look good. Oh. Dash blade. Shoot, shoot. Oh. 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 Okay. I don't like you. Um, dash, shoot. Um, this guy is the bigger threat. Um, shoot, dash, blade. Do I do it? I uh, no that that was that was not it. That was not it. Um, dash blade. Okay. Dash blade and then switch positions. Gotta take some damage here. and dash. I mean, shuriken. Yeah, okay. Just do this and dash. And we survived. So far, so good. Alright guys, um, I don't want to have this video go too long. Uh, this has been Shogun Showdown. I, I hope you guys like this game. I liked it a lot. Um, uh, if you did, um, as I said, link will be in the description for the itch.io page. You can go down there, download the game, and play it for yourself. Um, let me know what you think. I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, and if you don't know who I am, my name is Marshall Gamer, and when it comes to video games, it is my policy to bring you great quality. I'll see you next time.